Insects are eating machines. Nothing is safe from their jaws. A rotten banana. Heaven to a weevil beetle. These little suckers are aphids, dining on the juice of a rosebud. Leaf cutter ants work together to bring home a bumper harvest. Herodula needs to make one kill a day. Papilio must keep on munching. There's no shortage of greenery here, enough to satisfy even the hungriest caterpillar. The tropical rainforests cover only 2% of the Earth's surface. But they are home to most of the world's species of animals and plants. And with good reason. The jungle has a magic recipe. Sun, steam and lots of rain. In this weather, even bugs need umbrellas. In her search for food, Papilio has strayed into a dangerous neighborhood. Her simple eyes can only distinguish light from dark. She hasn't spotted her rodula. But he's already eaten and pays no attention. 
Like all insects, a rodula wears his skeleton on the outside. It's made of a strong and versatile substance called chitin. On Herodula, it's hard and protects him like a suit of armor. A clash of chitin is beginning on the floor below. The aim, flip your opponent. The weapons, three vicious chitin spikes. Prize, a female. The rules, first one to hit the deck is the loser. For their size, these rhinoceros beetles are amongst the strongest creatures on Earth. Both gladiators are battle-weary, but the winner still has the strength to take a bow. His prize is waiting. The loser leaves town. Papilio is not built for battle, but she is a champion eater. To accommodate her ever-expanding waistline, she wears a soft coat of chitin. It's that skill at getting around that makes bugs world-class travelers. <laughs>